Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to Miss Survival. Yes, it's been a long ass time since uh, my last video or my last stream. It's been almost 12 months, uh, to be honest. Is that a deer? It bloody well is, look. Cheeky little bugger coming up to pay us a visit. Uh, yeah, anyway, uh, yeah, it's been uh, 12 months uh, or so since my last video or stream any of you guys that have been following me in the past will understand probably why um especially you guys that have been sending me um, messages through steam and uh, and what have you much appreciated guys big big time much appreciated um but i thought to myself uh last night actually it was my son he came up and he said look dad even even though you know what 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 you've gone through and things like that why give up on something you know that you you like to do and that was youtubing it's been it's been tough i i i can i can or that's all i can say um if you guys want to know any more you know we can talk about that uh, at a later time but uh but at the moment we're back um with missed survival what is miss survival all about well basically the world has been overrun with uh, i was just going to say zombies but they're actually mutants i might i may slip up once or twice or 1500 times and call them zombies so apologies for that straight off um so yeah it's been over overrun with uh, mutants and they come out during the mist which happens maybe once or twice a day and uh and night time they will come out so you need to go and find yourself somewhere suitable to set up a camp yeah there is building in the game for any of you guys that uh, don't know what mist is all about i shall if i remember to leave a, a link down below um and you'll be able to see what the game is all about there um so yeah, uh, well, where do we start? Well, we just started. We just picked up. This is our base at the moment. This this simple little lean-to, and it had a couple of little things on it. And you, if you click on the little book there, it basically says at the bottom left, uh, uh, small house is set as base. So that is that is um, set a default if you like until you find uh, a bigger or a better place where you know that you want to set up so anyway i haven't got a clue where we are on the map because there isn't a map as far as i can see now if you go on my past videos um even back nearly 12 months ago i think i did put a um a video up um showing you a map that was actually created by somebody else but i just sort of uh, uh, show you guys uh, what it what the way and how big the map is now i'm led to believe that there was a quite a substantial update um back in uh when was it october time uh where they uh, uh ratty has put in a few things uh so there's a six maximum save slot now new game will be generated new save slot automatically uh blah, 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 blah uh there's a base shelter save as well there, there's a few things like i said i'll, I'll leave a, a link oh sparkers take those um there, there's a few things um in there that uh, that you might find interesting gonna take the wheels because we're gonna yeah we can uh, get a vehicle there's i think there's two kinds of vehicle here. i don't know if ratty maybe updated it and put more in i'm not sure but uh, at the moment i'm just going to go on the two this is one this four by four like um land rover if you want to yeah it looks similar to a land rover isn't it? or range rover um and it's got quite a quite a big um inventory uh space in it so we can put those things in there uh matches i don't need those as yet coke uh i don't need the axe uh, the, the axe the saw at the moment so we're going to leave that in there for now because there are a few areas if i remember right around here that you can actually loot and find uh, other things so we're going to need some sticks so we can make us a, um, a spear you know a spear is going to be obviously your base oh there's another one um uh, your basic go-to sort of like first weapon these vehicles here you can't loot these but if you get a 
uh, let me think, a hatchet or a um, sledgehammer, you can smash that up and it will give you uh, resources. Not all of them do. If I remember right, there may be the odd one or two that don't. Uh, there's another wheel. We'll take that. Oh, yes. And there's also, if I hold down my shift button now, I've just got to click, click. Yes. That is something that we all wanted oh, a long, long, long time ago. Um, but it wasn't coming. But it is in there now. It's there now. Well, can't speak. Can't lie, as they say. Can't speak, can't lie. Well, what we got here? Got a hammer on the table. We'll take that. Let's go upstairs and see what's what's up here for us. So, yeah, starting off in the game, you really got to go in for gathering straight off. Um, and things like this. Oh, there's a knife. Uh, things like this you can uh, store stuff in and you can actually take it with you so if I oh we got a pistol happy days take that uh, is that for yeah there you go 33 pistol that is a 30 yes a 9, nine 11 90 uh, what they call it oh 1191 so we're going to put that ammo away because I can't use that there's another wheel there I'm going to take this uh, suitcase with me I think um yeah, let's take that with us. Let me just check through the rest of the... Oh, there's a backpack, and that will give me... You'll see, like, there's a, a plus two slot above it. That's going to give us two extra slots. So if I just quickly go into my inventory, you'll see those two are... Uh, we can actually um, put up to there. So once I've collected that, you'll see there we've got another two, two extra slots. I know that was just use, useless information, but <laughs> hey... Now you can take um, storage containers and things like that, but you can never lift these drawers up and take those, which I think could have been ideal. But you can leave stuff in there, you know, and uh, so if you're ever about this way again, you you know, oh yeah, I remember I put some stuff in those drawers, didn't I? Yeah, I'd go back and get those. Uh, whether stuff respawns in them, I, I don't know whether that's been a thing. Uh, those drawers are not um lootable so let's take this pick it up just press uh m can we open the door okay we'll open the door and then drop it can it will it open inwards it does sweet so let's pick that bad boy up and we can then drop that down about there somewhere Yay! right so then rather than you know messing up the video with a, a suitcase floating in your face we just drop it over the edge. Now we just got to find it again. Um, there it is. Okay, let's pick that bad boy up. We'll take it back down towards where that car is. Um, we'll put uh, the other wheel inside the uh, the inventory, if you like, of the truck. We could put the wheels on now, but the thing is, it's. Um, I'm going to put that there so I know it's. What would you call it? Um, oh, excuse me. Right, so wheel. So that's that's two wheels we've got, and a set of plugs. Oh no, that's going into my inventory, isn't it? You idiot. So let's put those in there. Told you. You see, mistakes were made already. So nothing else for the vehicle. But I'm going to put uh, the tools in there. The matches can come down there. Uh, the knife I'm going to carry on with me. Uh, we'll just put those in there. That in there. Food. Um, I'm going to put that one inside there. We'll just carry these two cans. There's water. That's got 55, 0.55 litres in it. Uh, so we don't necessarily need that because we'll just drink the water. And the knife can go down in slot number four. They can go in there. And we'll keep those, those rounds on us. And these sticks, obviously, I'm going to make myself a, a spear or two if I can find another uh, another stick. There's bound sure to be some around here, you would have thought, wouldn't you? There's one and a stone. Pick up the stones because you can make uh, like campfires and I think if, uh, a smelter. Um, like a big ass forge, if you like. Uh, let's have a look at our inventory. Go to. Uh, where is it? That one? No, that one there. 
so we can click it's going to take 20 minutes to make that so let's make one at least um, and then put that into slot number three okay all good so so we're going to go around and have a good old uh, nosy around there has like i say be, been that big ass update uh, back in october time um and i've not really read up on anything that have uh, that's been implemented uh, you know that's even if anything's been implemented um so I, i'm i'm as green to this as you guys are so there you go but anyway getting on to what what have i been doing over the last 12 months because i cannot just jump in and um you know expect you guys to take my video and you know without any explanation but anyway as far as it goes is me and my wife we separated uh two years ago and uh she's gone off and she's found herself a new guy and she's starting up a, a fresh life which was pretty damn hard for me to to take as you can imagine we were together for 27 years married for 25 um I have three great um, children uh, by her and uh, three stepchildren, uh, which I love dearly. Uh, yeah, so it was difficult um, to to accept what what's gone on, if you like. Um, but I'm in a better, better, better sort of place at the moment. My son made a good a good point last night. He came visiting. Um, and he made, he made a very good strong point he said dad why you know why don't you go back to um you know doing what you what you like to do youtubing don't don't get me wrong i you know the thought oh a rope uh the thought was um has been there for a number of months now guys you know what i mean because i didn't want to leave you you know without any sort of like explanation or anything like that of why i wasn't doing any more um videos it wasn't the fact that i didn't want to do anymore it's just i just could not uh i didn't have the heart to if you like i just didn't have the motivation motivation as as you know i've also got health problems myself copd so this coronavirus as you know if it's taught me anything it's to value life you know and when they ask you to stay at home um do it guys just do it it is hard but just imagine where we could be oh hang on here there we go oh we've got a shotgun and some rounds sweet uh but yeah like you know there's people like myself that have got you know um an incurable problem where you know with his lungs like and and the government is asking you to stay at home save lives and and protect the old nhs and what have you um and then you still see people run at walking down the streets as as if nothing is happening you know what i mean uh and there's people like me that i want to go out i want to do things um uh, but i can't because of the lockdown and we're all in the same sort of uh, you know position at the moment so whatever you guys do please please take good care of yourselves because you know who would i have to talk to if anything happened to any of you uh yeah so anyway um so that's sort of like roughly where i've been the last 12 months you know trying to battle through my own my own sort of like real life issues and the uh this coronavirus um pandemic whatever you call the bloody thing epidemic panadem, pa pandemic or wh whatever it is but yeah it's, it's been bloody hard for everybody so uh but anyway we're we're going to soldier on guys we are going to um try and get you uh we'll try and get us back to where we were you know um almost 12 months ago where my my you know the the people that were su subscribing to my channel it just you know it started getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and that is again much appreciated because uh as i think i've mentioned it in the past i don't do youtube in you know to make any money i've never done it you know what i mean and got no intentions on doing it i do it because i like to well try and entertain people uh in my own little way if it, and now it makes you laugh because um 
my good old friend Mr. Flynn, he was the guy that actually um, uh, designed my logo, if you like. And uh, yeah, so it's uh, Ziggy G. Oh, right. there we go. Nothing up there. Uh, what was it? Survival expert in training. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And you can guarantee we're going to fluff things up now and then, you know what I mean? But uh, we could do that together. I will eventually probably uh, start streaming again. Uh, I've bought a new computer, uh, and it's quite quite a beastly machine. Because um, one thing I thought about, you know, in the last 12 months, you know, I'm, I'm sat at home. I could be, uh, you know, uh, YouTubing and things. Um, you know, but how can I do that without a, uh, an half decent PC? So I say I bought one, and uh, yeah, so here we are. This is the machine I'm using. And uh, right, let's uh, drink, drink a little. We don't need a vast amount. There you go. Look at that. Oh, gusty. Right. So we pick that one up now. So now, my inventory is looking pretty damn full. So what can we do? Well, we've got a shotgun we can put down in there now. We've got five rounds, so this is not a bad start to uh, to uh, the video, is it? I know the first uh, video video of this um, the season, if you like. Oh, there's another bottle. So I just had a look twice there, and a third time. So yeah, that's not a bad uh, bad our start to uh, to us, uh, you know, our first episode of a new season. Um, or series, I should say. Season? What am I bloody season? Series. Um, you know, we've got a couple of good guns there. Uh, yeah, this is another vehicle, where, like I say, you can smash up and uh, use later on. Utilise later on, I should say. Now, going out this way, there is a garage. Now, if I remember right, there is also a bloody bear spawn around this these here parts. So, I'm, at the moment, I'm going to stick down this way i'm going to loot a few vehicles if i remember right there's also a garage of some sort further down there's a car that's lootable oh there's a house there we can actually oh look at that cigarette no that's bad no we don't want cigarettes i'm going to leave that in there uh nothing in there but there is fuel in there you'll see there's uh, 1.75 litres in there, so once we find a fuel can, we can put it in that slot and fill the can, and it will uh, siphon it, if you like. Now, there's a little shack there. I might, just for the first um, episode, maybe call this home. Yeah, because there is, a, there is a, a locker in there. Look, it's got a little bit of food in there. But we can put in, you know, all this stuff here if we want to. Let's put the old shift button down. Oh, that is so lovely, isn't it? Being able to just shift click. Oh, yes. Oh, simple things, you see. Please, simple minds. Now, does... I can't remember if the smelter needs a work uh, a workbench uh, for you to, um, to craft. Um, let me think. No, it comes under... Uh, B, wasn't it? Yeah, B. So workstations. Okay. A little, 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 little review. It doesn't say where it needs to be made, so I can make. I can get one of those made up pretty damn quick, actually. Just get a few more stones. Look at that one. Uh, why am I doing that? Well, I can get some scrap metal. I can turn it into the. Uh, the iron ingots that we're going to be needing to make the uh, the sledgehammer. See, there's been a few other vehicles. That, I can't remember that, that caravan being there uh, the last time I played. So he may have actually... Always oh, a truck down there. Uh, he may have actually uh, brought in a few more vehicles. Yeah, there's, there's that little building I was on about. But this is the little garage didn't check to see if there was any bad guys in here <laughs> just walk straight in yeah hello good morning <laughs> yeah how was your business all right so let's pick all this crap up here well i say it's crap it's it's lovely crap all right some more drawers here we can use for storage there's a, a hatchet um which we can use to uh cut the old trees down some more ammo um, more of those some cloth Nothing. 
nothing okay a bit more scrap there and uh, nothing else nothing's jumping out oh, oh there's another piece of scrap there we'll take that oh there's a lock box here look oh hang on we've got some more uh, look at it i'll tell you what we're being spoiled seriously we're being bloody spoiled so let's put that in there how many rounds can we stack up to so we, we may as well stack them up haven't we um ba -da -ba -da -bum -bum -bum. Right, so what was it i needed i need oh what did i do then did i just drop something oh no where's it all um oh no it's all gone back in there turd all right let's put that back in there then uh let's get rid of those as well for a moment and that bit of scrap now what i'm going to do with this is i'm going to just take it back to the uh the little shack that we've got uh, those sticks can go in there as well I'll put that over there that there and put that there right so let's pick this bad boy up I can't can't say that I can see anything else in here if I do uh, forget anything please 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 let me know uh, let's pick you up a bit of more scrap more rags I wonder, can we get up on the roof of this? Oh, we can. Oh, there's nothing up here. Oh, there is. There's a stone. Look. Take that. Let's jump back down. Nope, oh, no full damage. That's cool. Can live with that. Some berries there. But berries don't really give you a vast amount of uh, uh, hydrate, you know, your, your, your hydration or your food. Oh, I saw another stone just there pick up these old th these old sticks because like I say we can make um, make spears so uh, so yeah so anyway I, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier but I think there's a new uh, church uh, hang on let me just see if I can um... alright okay yeah I just went on to my other screen there uh, added church farm area uh, oh, there you go. Added three cars in farm area. Okay, so not letting not not letting much go there, really. But where is the farm? That's the thing. Yeah, you know I mean, we 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 want to go and check that farm out as soon as possible. Duct tape? Do we need duct tape? Not this early in the game, I don't think. Um, close the door. More duct tape. They're obviously telling us something here. Check behind the doors as well, because you never know. Something might be hiding there. Very clean in there. Nice. Oh, I can't see anything else. Nothing that's sort of like jumping out at me. No storage chests. Some more rags. Components. Oh my days, look at these amount of bottles. Now you need the bottles, obviously, for um, uh, bandages and what have you later on, I think. If, I'm pretty sure that's what we needed them for. Like I said, it's been such a while since I've um, since I've played this game. So, oh, it says nothing in there. Uh, there was a staircase. Now, is there anything in here? Can't hear any bad guys. So we're going to go in. We got oh, look at this! More ammo. Nice. Okay. Okay. Batteries. Well, okay, we'll take them. Like I said, I'm not sure if anything's been brought in because remember, uh, I think I think it was the last time we played. You know, we was on about the batteries and we didn't really have any use for them. But perhaps now there is, so I'm going to gather them if they're uh, if they're lying around. But uh, but yeah, well, I'll tell you what, this ain't a bad start to. Uh, to our first video mate you know uh you know considering the amount of time now the farm was it over there where those barns were you know where we set up camp before i don't know do we want to go over there probably not um although if we do go over there there was a place that we could um hide away from the bad guys if you like 
Ah, now there's... Aha! Right, okay, I remember this now. You remember we, we sort of like put some floating... Uh, was it plant pots? Uh, sorry, grow plots or whatever you call them on there? Right next to the water? Okay, so now one of these wood yards has got a... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, a smelter. Is it this one? See, there's another place that we can we can use. Oh no, that that's what it was. The saw bench. Now we can move that bad boy. We can pick that up. A uh, bit of scrap. We we'll take that. Let me just check to see if there was any uh, work. No, no storage boxes. Anything behind the door? No. So, to me, this would be like the farmy kind of area, because you've got these big-ass barns. Now, was this... I think this may have been uh, the barn that we took over in the last uh, uh, series, which I didn't actually get to finish off, because because of the big update, it deleted all of my... I'm oh, saying that I've got a new computer now, so uh, that was that's probably why... I've had to start from scratch, but if we needed to get out out of the way of the old uh, mutants, we could climb up there. That's exactly where I'm going. And this is not. Oh, there you go. We need one of. Oh, okay. We need one of those. How are we doing for food and water? Let's. Uh, I tell you what. Let's just eat that one because that that will hydrate us as well shortly. I, I know we don't really need it, but I need the room. Everything that we're ga gathering, uh, collecting at the moment is like, you know, gold to us. So we can pick that up now. So we... Oh, look at this. More ammo. Jeez, Louise. Happy days. Oh, and a backpack. Nice one. Like I said, you've got to look everywhere. Seriously, look absolutely everywhere. Because you just never know what little uh, secrets Ratty has put into the game, maybe. You know? That was a that was an added bonus. Oh look at this, two tins of food. Now it's a shame these things don't stack. Oh and more ammo. Uh, oh ammo I can't pick up. Jeez. Uh let's get rid of that stick. Let's just drop that on the ground there. We can pick those up all day long. A little radio? Oh I'd like that. Oh this is nice. Oh what's this? Chocolate bar? We'll leave those sort of things there. Um so if we're ever around this way again. We can uh, we can just come in here for a bit of a snack. All right, let me just check around the lower part here just to see if there were any more um, backpacks or something. You know, because you never know. Because you can't get up over on this side, can you? Oh, you can. Oh, you can. Oh, I didn't realise that. Could we do that before? Can't remember. Pick that up. A bit of wood. Nothing there. Nothing in there. Right, okay. Uh, there's another bottle. And another bottle. Can't see it. Oh, a bit more duct tape. We'll take that as well. And some more cloth. Okay. Oh, and more bottles. Now, eventually... Oh, I'll leave that one there. Uh, eventually, I'm going to probably go to the... Uh, maybe the White House... Uh, I don't know yet. Let me go. Uh, let me know what you think, guys. Would you like us to uh, to set up camp at the uh, the White House, or or just start out fresh? You know, can't pick that up, so we'll leave that for next time. Speaking of next time, guys, that is uh, my quota for today. Or oh, is a helmet? I'll probably pick that up in a minute. Um, that's going to be my quota for today. Uh, the 30 minute record is basically just uh, about to come to an end. So if you've liked today's uh, video guys and would like to see more, please don't hesitate and hit the old like button. Subscribe if you're new and would like to see any more. Because now I'm back, there is going to be more. Um, not sure about every day, but we, we shall see. We'll play it by ear for now. Um, but it's great to be back and uh, again I want to thank you all for your continuous uh, support in staying with me actually because like I said earlier I think I said it earlier anyway uh, about the amount of subscribers that I had 
back in almost 12 months ago and how many have still stayed with us and uh, all I can say is a huge thank you to you all so anyway then guys so until the next episode then love to you all stay safe don't take any risks as far as this coronavirus is concerned you know you want to see tomorrow yeah stay safe love to you all bye bye for now bye bye